My name is Steve Lewis. My job on the project is Education Centre Manager. So here we are in the Bristol Education Centre, which opened a couple of weeks ago. Part of my job is making sure that we've got lots of interesting stuff to do here. The other part of my job is working with the rest of the team to try and ramp up all the online resources that we're able to offer schools. The centre is open for all manner of um, educational groups, so that's from Key Stage 1 up to college students and also youth groups etc. The unique thing about Bloodhound as an education project is that we've got a real life engineering project going on and that we can use that as a focus and a stimulus um, to, to generate interest in, in the topics that are being taught at the time. The location of the Bristol Centre is within SMB Automotive Academy, uh, which is basically a college for 16 to 19 year old learners. And really our relationship started with them when they wanted to have Richard Noble come along and speak at an opening ceremony for them. So we sat down, we talked to them about that. Then within two weeks, they'd booked Richard, they'd got their name on the side of the car and become a, um, an SME sponsor. And then also they'd kind of offered a space for an education center. So basically we joined forces and um, did a joint opening between us. We had 16 schools groups turn up, which was quite a lot. I've got to say, but I think we managed to keep them all busy because we had lots of activities going on ourselves, as well as s &B, they'd organised some activities as well, which was great. So we had the Supercat, which is our rocket exchange vehicle for the desert. The classic balloon cars. Uh, we also had our air-powered cars. And so you can make a car up at Connects and you can race down the track. And we had, we've got a nice track set up with the timing gate. So we had the leaders ball projected on the wall and everyone could see how they were doing over the day. Um, on our Intel classmates, we had the genome loaded up, which is all the CAD data for the car, which allowed groups of students to sit down and explore to whatever level they wanted to um, the inner workings of the Bloodhound. We also had uh, Hugh, who's part of our education team. He was doing some science busking, so some nice simple experiments, you know, typically blowing things up, which is what he likes doing. And we also had lots of visiting uh, sort of dignitaries and the press and all the local media. So now the opening's out of the way and now the real hard work begins. Um, but I'm really looking forward to welcoming lots of schools and college groups here um, and hopefully getting the message across that science, technology, engineering and maths are really interesting, really important subjects that you can have a lot of fun with. Brought the year eights and have a, a low attendance currently in STEM for this year group. So we're hoping that some of the kids here will be so enthused with engineering and technology that they'll want to come and join our STEM club and get involved in our activities we've got planned for this year. This is the first time we've come here and looked at it and it's been interesting. When we came here yeah, it was really nice. Fascinating. Look, we, yeah, fascinating because we could see all the cars, you know, we could see the cars, the simulators, the, how it works. First time I've ever heard yeah. of it. Yeah, and this is like one of the first times I've heard of it. And I want to go here again. Cheese!